this your first time in the contest? Yes, it is. What was it like in that call? Oh my God, it was so exciting. And I was just thrilled after waiting months after we submitted the recipe, but then they said, mom's the word, you can't tell anyone. So I'm like, oh, for months we can't tell anyone. But now the day is here and it's like a lifelong dream come true. What was the reaction from friends and family? When you oh, they were so proud of me because they know I love to eat, I love to cook. So they know this is like the mecca of cooking contests. <laughs> And how do you prepare for uh, this big day? Well, I couldn't sleep. That's how I prepared because <laughs> it, it's so exciting. You really can't sleep. And I was so pleased to meet all the finalists and they have such terrific recipes. And I, I, I downloaded some of them even before the little cookbook came up. And so I'm going to cook a bunch when I get back home. <laughs> awesome. And I, I heard you were a big Martha Stewart fan. She's yes. When I was growing up, aside from having an easy big oven and all that, and watching all the TV chefs on TV, like Alvin Gourmet, Julie Tonzo, and Martha Stewart kind of stood out to me because she lived a hectic lifestyle and balanced work and, and her career with family life. And so I tried to make easy recipes.